What is up? Gear Squad, Chain Gear here, bringing another video. And today, I wanna to talk to you guys about two things. I wanna to talk to you about the movie Venom, and I wanna to talk to you about what's coming up next. Um, it has been a crazy first week here in San Francisco. Last video I made was all about me moving here into this new place, this new temporary apartment that I'm staying in, um, literally in the middle of San Francisco. And it's been crazy, it's been a crazy time. I started my job at Facebook, um, and I do have a video coming up about Facebook, about starting there. There are a lot of things I can't talk about, and there are some things that I can. So I took pictures, um, so we're gonna do kind of like a slideshow type of thing, which I know might be a little lame, but I have a couple of videos as well, but overall, like I wanna just tell you my experience about Facebook, how it got started and everything like that, how rough it's been without video games i have not played my playstation 4 in a month and about a week now um that's been a little rough and i'm not gonna have my ps4 for another three weeks but um there's some news that i'll talk about next week and i will be able to play a little bit but i'll talk to you guys about that in a second so um what i wanted to talk about now is venom i just saw venom uh in the movies and um here's the back of it this is pretty cool uh, and look, if you guys have seen the trailers, you might have been like, yo, this movie looks dope. This movie looks sick. I'm so excited. And then you might have heard about the reviews and the reviews are bad. The reviews are bad. I'm talking like threes, fours, fives. And some people are like giving it a little bit higher than that. So I think at the average, it's like averaging out like five. Some places say that it's four. Um, but it's rough. It's having a really rough time. But I wanted to go see it anyway. I got some discount tickets. Um, saw it in IMAX. Literally, I have a movie theater right down the street, AMC. And I, like I said, it has IMAX. They didn't have the really comfy chairs, but it was fine. I really enjoyed Venom. Look, I'm not, and, and I'm not saying that you should, you know, keep your expectations high. I knew that the movie was supposed to be bad, um, and I went to go see it anyway. And I thoroughly enjoyed it. From the very beginning to the very end, I enjoyed it the whole time. Now, there were some things that were a little cringy. So if you guys don't know, it's about Eddie Brock, who's the actual guy in the movie. Um, and it's about him being taken over by the symbiote, which is the not guy, the thing that you kind of see behind him, the webby looking thing. That's a symbiote. Um, and the symbiote's name, the actual alien thing that takes over Eddie Brock, the, the dude in the movie, um, he's an alien. And and they go through that in the movie. I, I'm, I hope I'm not spoiling anything because that's like classic Venom. Like if you guys don't know about Venom and the comic books in general, like that is kind of well known. Now the rest of it, I won't spoil like what happens in terms of the storyline. It is a little bit different uh, than the comic books. And this is, this is a comic book that you get when you go to the movie i just realized that i think today is opening night um i think i'm not 100 percent sure but uh i really enjoyed it um he has a girlfriend in the movie uh, and some things happened there and i thought that it was fine like i thought that the love interest was fine and how that went um the main villain definitely had some issues definitely sh like struggled um in terms of like being a good villain uh he I mean, there were that was definitely one of the biggest issues. But in terms of Eddie Brock and um, and Venom, the two main characters, um, which become one, they were really good. They were fun. I really enjoyed watching them. I really enjoyed seeing them interact and things like that. And if you're in it just to see Venom and just to see that interaction, highly recommend the movie. Um, I probably wouldn't spend a million dollars on the movie. If you like IMAX and stuff like that, go see it in IMAX. I did not see it in 3D. I don't like 3D. Um, and I didn't feel like I was missing anything. So if you don't want to spend the money there, that's fine. But if you like really don't want to spend the money or if you do want to see it, but you heard the, you know, the, you know, the, the reviews and stuff, maybe go see a matinee like in the morning or, or, um, yeah, before lunch and maybe get it like, you know, an $8 ticket or go, uh, during a Tuesday. Tuesday. Sometimes Tuesdays at your movie theaters will be on sale, like five dollar Tuesdays or five dollar Wednesdays, depending. Um, so check that out as well. Otherwise, wait for it to come out. I think it's worth watching. I, I really did like it. If you like comic books, there are many people who left the theater really excited about it. There were a lot of um, trailers for superhero movies, and a lot of people were like, "Oh, these movies look lame," and then they watched 
Venom, and they were like, wow, that was really good. Um, the temporary housing building I'm staying at, I got on the elevator, and two people who were you know just on a date, I'm assuming, that were there, got on the elevator and went up, and they said, oh, did you come on the movie too? Because again, I you know I have the comic book. Um, and I said, yeah, and they're like, I really like the movie. And I was like, yeah, the reviews were really bad, and they had no idea. Um, but they really liked it. So anyway, I just wanted to put my two cents in there. Um, you guys can take a look uh, at the reviews if you want. Um, you can make your own decision about it. If you wanted to go see it, you know, maybe tamper your expectations, but enjoy it. I like movies, so I tend to just enjoy them no matter what, unless they're terrible. Um, but I didn't think this movie was terrible. I thought it was fine. It just wasn't at the level at, like these other Marvel movies were at. But this also is is in conjunction with Marvel. This is a Sony movie, just so everybody knows. Um, that's about it, guys. I will be online in a couple weeks, um, it'll take me a while, and then I'm going to be playing a lot of Destiny, um, and then I've got a lot of catching up to do on new games, old games, Paladins just had a huge update that I haven't been able to play, so lots of things there. Uh, I will have a video coming out about Facebook. Also, if you guys have been here till the end, and I will talk about this um, later, uh, maybe this weekend, but probably next week, my girlfriend's coming here. <laughs> so if you guys don't know, Scarlett EK, uh, she has a YouTube channel as well. Um, but she'll be here um, from Friday uh, uh, for a while. So we'll talk about that when she gets here. Um, we'll do some videos together and stuff like that. But I'm excited. So I'll talk to you guys later. I'll talk to you online. And of course, I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.